Hello Taurus here. I'm going to do you guys angelic mess, um, angelic messages here. I know you're going to say i done them before, but I had to redo them. Someone pointed out on me on the inbox and they didn't like the first ones because the back, the noise. I'm the type of person I dive and start reading and I blank stuff out easy and I forgot that thing was going on. I looked at the video and I'm like, oh my god. So I redid them and they're all new. This is all new deck here, okay? Um, so I did that over. And um, I thank the person for actually pointing that out for me. But um, you got seven. I'm going to go with seven because seven is also representing um, your inter intervening with your guardian angels. With the angels here. And if you get happen to get eight, eight is representing to prosperity with money and stuff like that. But that can go on into your transit too. And if a card comes reverse, I know you're saying that in an angelic oracle, yes. Because it could be the angels telling you what you're lacking and what you need to be aware of, okay? So you have seven. Yep. And I'm going to start the read here, okay? All right. This is downloads and understanding for Taurus here. Okay, I'm going to read the card here. It says, truth is being revealed. Deep insights are coming from heaven in the outer realms here. If you're trying to find out something, it's best that you deal with it in the spiritual world and the guardian angels are going to help you here that's what it's saying here because some of your understanding some of your not understanding things coming from family friends or just people that are not coming to you right or you think they're not coming to you right here okay and it's best that you hear it from your guardian angel or the spirit world trying to stay in your spirit transit because i told you this week people are going into their transit here Okay, you got to do it right here, okay? You can't try to figure out things for yourself or assuming things. That's why the angels are there for, for them to help you to understand things that you're trying to figure out, okay? Try to do that, Taurus, all right? And this is voice of truth here, okay? This is stand strong, focus on your purpose, Release the fear of persecution and speak your truth. You got to speak your truth about certain things. You can't keep holding things in. If you need help, ask for guardian angel help. That's what this read is all about. That's what the spiritual world is all about. A lot of people don't go to the spiritual side and they don't reach out like that. It's nothing wrong. You're in the universe. I know there are bad and good spirits here, but you're in the universe, and they're around us. Ask for help, and you don't want to keep assuming things here, okay? If you want the truth, you got to speak up about it. And it said, don't be afraid of the persecution. Persecution is talking about people. Why are you saying that? It's a stone's throw at you. I'll just put it like that. That don't have to happen if you're dealing with your spiritual side. Because you're not going to be afraid to do it. All right, and this is experiencing grace. Okay, this is share your gifts of grace. Ways of inspiration and love are coming to you. Love is not going to come to you unless you're sharing, unless you're pushing out goodness here. I'm not talking about intimacy and giving out gifts. I'm talking about what's inside of you that's real. If you're dealing with the spirit world. Because guardian angels is not going to deal with you giving someone money and all this foolishness. It's about what you're com what's coming from your heart. That's how they deal with you. And that's what you get back. Because people are going to take if you're going to give. Remember that. But what you're sharing with love is that's when you're going to see when it's the right person. Okay, so whatever you're putting out, that's what you're going to get back. Now, if you want to get back to wholeness, which I told you guys this week and all next week and all months or whatever to come, there's a lot of goodness coming to people here. You got to do the right thing here. So however you were coming to a person here, that's how they're coming back to you here. You got to think about this here. And don't be afraid to go into your spiritual sense. Okay? And this is, open, again, look, open communication. Something about your cards are coming out. These spirit, these angels feel like some communication is off with something. With someone or some people. Get a weight off your chest. Speak up with love and be heard. You see, all your cards are about speaking the truth and communication here. 
this is Mercury Open Communication. These are just symbols of angels or certain prophets or kings that have been through something. And the guardian angels are used with certain particular situations that you're going through, okay? You have to speak up about things here. Don't assume things in your head just because of how a person is acting or what they said. Because you don't know why they said it. You don't know why they're not talking. You don't know what's going on. It's good to get the truth. And if you need help with facing someone or talking to someone about it, pray to God about it. Guardian angels here. That's what the read is here for. Okay? This is sacred self for Taurus here. Okay? This is unleash your spirit. Express your gifts, dance to the sacred rhythm of life here. They're telling you to release a gift that you have. Some of you are holding back things because of something you're feeling about in your head and in your heart. If it's something that's not serving you to go to a new, good, positive, prosperous life, shut it out. Because nothing is going to be released of good of this here. They're trying to help you. The angels don't have step with anything. They're not going to deal with something that's dark and gray areas and assuming things. They don't deal with things like that. You have to come out right and heal from these things here. And if you want to know something, talk to the person. It depends on who it is though. And if you need some time, a long time to heal, then that's what you need here. God, the angels have all, they wait forever for you. But you don't want to wait forever for your life to change, all right? All right? You got to make things right with yourself and with people that you're dealing with here. Okay? Your circle or whatever you got going on here. I'm not a big fan of particular, but some people have particular people they deal with here. And if they're not serving you, you got to change up some things here, Taurus, okay? And this is life forces here. And I know some of you, if you're a spiritual person, when I tell, tell you about this card, you're going to say, why is that card in here? I'm going to explain why, okay? This says, um, express your driven passion. Sensual and sexual powers are increased. I know you heard that SEX word, but they should have said intimacy. It's very important to have some passionate side about yourself in the physical. Because when you do that, it releases toxins. It's not about getting your keep your thing on it's not about that it's about releasing toxins that's exercise for your inner soul your inner being of yourself here and a lot of you shut that out how do you think you got here in the world why do you think it feels a certain way because you're releasing something it's like your it's like your inside of your soul was stretching here and the, if you need help with that, you need help with that because that's important a part of your life here. And I was about to say something. God stopped me. Oh, my God. I'm not gonna I'll just say you don't want things to die out. I'll just leave it like that. It's an important part of your life here. You know, don't let people talk you wrong out of things here. That's important to your life and to your into your nerves, into your mind, your soul, and how you feel about life desires. A lot of us block our desires with things and we end up folding. That's not good for your body. Alright? And this is trusting heaven here. This is Archangel Michael here. They just, you know, you certain people who are probably going through something similar to what you're doing. Not similar to them, but you know what I mean. You are safe. Angels stand close to you. Surrender your concerns and allow a miracle to occur. You got, if you don't, if you can't put something together how the way you think it should be, which... I don't know how you want it to be. I don't know how you're putting this together. Let them help you. They know what's before you. They know what's going on. They know why these people are doing this. They know what's happening. They know what you did. They know everything. But when you ask for the help, that's when things start happening, Taurus. That's when things start happening. 
don't be afraid to go into your spiritual self. Okay? Because I know a lot of people, I got this. I know what I'm doing. I got this. And you're back in the same vicious cycle. You're back in the same circle. You're, back, you're still back with the same intoxication. You're back with the same things. Ask for the help. Drop the pride down. Ask for the help. Don't be afraid. You got to believe. You got to have faith. If you're trying to go into transit, how are you going to go into transit bringing that baggage along with you? Bringing that same stuff with you here. If you want change, you got to make change. If you want good, you got to be good here. And I know some of you are probably not interacting with certain people, and that happens. That's life. You tell God to forgive you, and I have to move on here. I have to move on. Because God is not going to, you know, I'm going to tell you something. And this is just all natural, what we should know. They're not going to deal with you when you're dragging in a lot of baggage. They're going to deal with you when you call on them for help. They might show you signs. And messages of get away from this or do this or do that. And some people don't pay attention to them. But when it's really that time when you need them is when all the chips failed. Okay? You don't want to wait that long. So take advantage of their advice and their openness to you right now. Okay, Taurus? I see you guys. Thanks, you guys, for watching. I'm going to get these up. All right, you guys take care of yourself and be safe. Thanks for watching. Hope I see you guys soon again. All right, you guys take care and good luck with your journey here. All right, bye now.